In the cat attachment portfolio, there are multiple different ways to get compaction, whether you're compacting gravel, sand, base, multiple different types of soil, ranging from compactor plates, which are offered on mini excavators and backhoe loaders, or you can also do that with the use of a vibratory compactor or a roller, as we have shown here on a compact track loader behind me. These are also compatible with skid steer loaders, multi-terrain loaders, and compact wheel loaders, but this gives you a wide frame in order to provide almost 12 thousand pounds of down pressure into that soil to get that compaction. Now the advantage of using a lower ground pressure machine such as this track loader is that you can run over sprinkler heads with this drum compactor, have that ability to work around them but not have a dedicated machine where you might damage things on the underground surface that you're working around such as in a baseball diamond or in this case a parking lot that's getting ready to be paved. Now when we look closer at the vibratory roller, we use CAT XT3 hosing that hooks up to the quick disconnects that you can release under pressure when you remove this tool. You follow these hoses down into a heavy duty frame and a non-metallic scraper that is spring loaded and make sure that it removes any debris that you pick up, whether that be mud or slop, on top of the steel heavy duty roller and make sure that you're not beating it back into the ground, leaving undulating surfaces or non-smooth surfaces as this is going to create Create a great finished product. Now this drum will also oscillate on its axis, which is center pivoted, 15 degrees. So when you have a machine that's over onto a higher area, that roller will actually compensate for that and smooth out that area, making sure that you get the accurate compaction that you're looking for. Now let's move down into the business end of the tool. Heavy duty frame comes over here into a Gerotor style motor. This is a variable speed motor, which allows you to use the thumb roller inside the cab of that D series all the way back into A series skid steer loader machines, giving you the use of creep control, modulating that speed all the way to what you need for that 10,000 or 12,000 pounds of force that you're putting into the ground. Now this is going to vibrate at about 3,000 vibrations per minute, making sure that you compact all that air, all that water out of the soil, getting to the accurate compaction, whether it be sand, gravel, soil, whatever that you're working on. Now, you've got three pods here. These are factory sealed that have weights in them as well as bearings. So these need to be replaced about every 3,000 hours, but you ensure that you have a long working life and you can replace those very easily with the use of this tool. Now that is a CAT exclusive design that gives you the ultimate in performance when it comes to compaction, getting you to that finished product. So when you lay that asphalt down or you lay that concrete on a housing pad, it's gonna be perfect right from the get-go. As we work around the tool, you can see that this is a 1.8 meter frame. This is a CV-18B. There's also a CV-16B. The CV-16B is slightly shorter, 1.6 meters in working width, but they share the same in both performance and features. That 12,000 pounds of down pressure going right into the ground from that machine and use of the standard flow hydraulics. You also have two serrated heavy duty steps here on board that heavy duty frame, making sure that you can get up into this cab very easily and safely each and every time. For more information about these vibratory compactors, whether it be in the roller form as we show here for compact wheel loaders, compact track loaders, multi-terrain loaders, and skid steer loaders, or you want to learn more about the vibratory compactor plates for backhoe loaders and mini hydraulic excavators, I encourage you to check us out at cat.com, visit us on YouTube, and I'll look forward to seeing you next time.